Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody sent me this file that they're going to cut out of metal, and they say that when they click on that on a node, they don't have any count of nodes. Well, you need to take your shape tool and select it all. It's still not going to show the nodes. It shows 119 objects. It's because the objects aren't grouped together. There's more than two ways to do this, but the the best way is the Smart Fill tool to fill it in. And then you can left click, right click, make sure it's a hairline. I would not, I always make mine RGB, but I don't think it really matters in this case. But I, in plasma cutting, I don't, I honestly don't know. But now you can take the shape tool and select all that. And we've got 1,037 nodes. Now, when I said it was, the, and there's really no bad nodes in here. It's just a lot of cutting. But <clears throat> the other way to do it is to combine. Because I was playing around with this file, and if we look at it individually, if we take the, look at all the nodes on there. There are double nodes on every corner. Well, what could that be a result of? See that star moving away when I unclick it, it's not really there? Well, that's a problem because it is there, but it's a weird shape, maybe because of the way I drug it. But So if you, let's go back. If you take this item and select it all and go to object to combine it to get your node count, You've got 1,806, 1,816 nodes versus you've got almost 800 more nodes. It's because you've got a double image there on top of each other. So it's always a good idea to use the Smart Fill tool. And here's a good example. I'm going to hit plus on the keyboard. I've got two exact copies. I can't see them. I don't know. I didn't draw it. They look good it will tell you that there's two objects, but if you happen to have it broken apart, let me see if I can, but I guess I can't because they're two objects. But if you don't happen to notice that, you know, it's just gonna show because we're only clicking on one, but you've got a whole nother flag behind there. So always, Smart Fields tool is always a good answer because now we just have one and here we still have two. I hope that helped. Thank you for watching.